Assassin's Creed Brotherhood game short move, short review. Ezio continues his attacks against the Borgia as they regain some of their power and control, and Desmond and his crew finally arrive at their destination, and I will not give away what that is. This is quite similar to the second, although it does finally gravitate towards more tension, and it brings in several very cool new abilities, such as the ability to, at pretty much any time, call in fellow assassins to help you, although this, you know, this requires a meter to be full and it will refill over time. There is a multiplayer mode with several different rule sets, maybe ten different rule sets and about a dozen and a half different models and it's very a, a very unique multiplayer experience. It's very similar to single player actually with sneaking and figuring out who the target is and killing the target before the target has a chance to run away or maybe kill you back. There is a lot of epic stuff in this game and it helps to make up for the there only being one location in, you know, the, you are in the city of Roma pretty much throughout the game. You know, you very briefly leave it for these little side quests, but yeah, very briefly only. Unlike the other games where you could go back and forth between the different cities, you know, as you pleased. In this one, you have to, you know, regain control of Roma, or give it back to the people, really, from the Borgia, and this in entails destroying towers from which the Borgia help rule the city, and obviously restoring all the shops and such, not unlike, you know, the second one, where you also had to, you know, or something, and destroying the war machines that Da Vinci has been forced to produce for them, and this is some of the most epic stuff of the game, actually, and it produces, it provides nice variety to the game. Each of the war machines that you actually eventually get to use yourself briefly to destroy the other war machines, each of them is a vehicle, and I refuse to give any more away than that. Similar to the others, this does end in a cliffhanger and with more new questions than answers to old questions. If you like this review and want a more detailed one, check below, it's there as a video response. If not, it'll be in the description box. I've reviewed other parts of this series, the links are in the description box. Please rate and comment, and hey, if you like this video, that subscribe button's just waiting for you to click it.